So as of late, you know NBA Youngboy been inside of Utah, but another rising rapper out of Mobile, Alabama goes by the name of Lil Ra. He's been making headlines because he's been dissing NBA Youngboy. I'm talking about back to back to back. And most of the songs that he's dropping, he's making references towards NBA Youngboy. Uh, and just, you know, I'm talking about dissing him. He said he can't go rack for rack with him, of course, you know, because NBA Youngboy's paid, paid. But he got on some other stuff, some screech stuff, you know, I'm talking about that he said he could do. But anyways, it looks like footage is actually being released by Bay. Baby Boy 10, which of course is being 10. Uh, he's actually released footage. Now, the, the Instagram was released on his Baby Boy 10, but uh, it's actually footage of Lil Rye getting jumped inside the mall. Now, of course, I can't put that footage on top on uh, YouTube because they're going to take it down ASAP, but I will put it on my Instagram account at Key Talk Media. If they take it from there, I'll put a link on my Instagram where y'all can actually go see it to my backup Instagram account. Now, as they beating him up and punching him, you can hear him saying, Give me the chain. Give me the chain. So they're definitely trying to get the chain. Now, did they get the chain? I don't believe they got the chain because it looks like Lil Rye ended up posting a video after that, which I'm going to show for y'all. I'm going to play it right now, actually. Check it out, man. All right. My chain right here. Stupid. I'm red. I didn't run to the police. I'm red. I run to the police. Y'all ran away. What the fuck? Y'all ran out the mall first. Never went out the mall five uh, deep and already went no police around us. What police? What screaming? Come on, man. Y'all for no reason. Real. That didn't make no sense. Now, as you can see by that video, it looks like Lil Rock still got his 1017 chain. Now, if he was to lose that 1017 chain, he probably has some other issues with his boss man, Gucci, because, of course, he is signed to Gucci Mane. Now, I expect nothing less from a 1017 artist than to be going through some stuff like this, because I told y'all already, almost all the artists on that label, you know, some Hot Boy West is locked up. I believe uh, Big Scar passed away. Pushais is locked up. And there's a whole long list of other people I'm sure that's into some type of trouble that y'all can name. But anyways, the NBA Youngboy crew, they don't play at all. Now, we can't exactly say that that was actually NBA Youngboy's crew that did that because BN10 did say on the video, you know, he posted on his Instagram and he said, Tag that good rapping at your little ride. How you got a blick in every video, but not on your stupid. This got nothing to do with me. So he pretty much didn't take any type of credit for that or NBA didn't take any type of credit for that at all. But, you know, talking about it is just the fact that the video was sent to him and he posted the video, you know, talking about just to show that that boy ain't really about nothing. You know, talking about he owner just good rapping. Anyways, so how do y'all think this go in? You know, talking about NBA young boys inside of Utah. Can't really get away, but... Obviously, NBA Youngboy got hands that reach further than a whole lot of other people because they got a lot of NBA fans and a whole lot of money. You know, I'm talking about stacking up where he can easily, you know, I'm talking about you giving them saying, ain't gonna say it, but you know, let me know something coming out below. Let me know what you think about this entire deal. I'm out.